Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be really honest. I don't know what I'm doing, but I just want to go. There's this Japanese store that I wanted to go to that I haven't gone to. And I also want to go out and eat by myself. So somewhere in Duluth, that's the general area that I'm going to. So I just want to bring you guys along and just see what I do. Okay, so we have arrived to the store and the store is called Ibisu Japanese Life Store. I can't even, I don't know if y'all can see that. Anyways, um, and so they're supposed to have a bunch of like beauty stuff and like Japanese snacks and I'm so excited. I saw it on a TikTok and I just wanted to come and see like what they had and maybe I'll buy something today. So they have a bunch of Sanrio stuff in the background and I found these adorable Hello Kitty water bottles. And they have a bunch of different drinks. I want something different that I haven't tried. And maybe I'll buy some candy, but I'm gonna keep looking around the store. So I just got back into my car and I got this, I think it's like juice and I'm gonna open it. Oh. And it smells really nice. Honestly, it's really good. I mean, it just tastes like peach. It reminds me of, I don't know what it reminds me of, but I've definitely tried this before or something similar. Okay, so now the next place that I came to is Super H Mart. And so for those who don't know, it has like a bunch of um, Asian products and like mostly Asian, but it has other products too. And it's like a, like a grocery store. So I'm gonna go in there. So it is getting a little chillier, so I put on my coat, but I think it should be warmer inside. And the last time I came, I saw a Hello Kitty toilet paper, which I thought was kind of cool, but let me see if I find it. So compared to like a regular supermarket, it has a lot more exotic fruits, like guavas. And I actually love guavas, and actually they're not too expensive, they're only two ninety nine right now. And like they have a bunch of other like fruits as well that you wouldn't find at Kroger or Publix, but I just like looking around and maybe I'll try something new. They have so many things in here. They have um, like a whole home section I guess and while I was walk walking by there they were like they had a kimchi section and it looked pretty cool and I could like smell everything so I just left and I'm just gonna go put my bag in the car and there's a bunch of like little stores and shops around here so um one of like a bookstore so I'm gonna go there and then um just I don't know, maybe I'll eat around here. Okay, so I went into the store, but I didn't find anything that compelled me to buy anything. And I think I want to go to another supermarket. I'm not really looking for anything specific, but I don't know. I, I'm i starting to get hungry, but I'm gonna hold off as long as I can. I mean, it's not even that late. It's like, I think it's like six, but I still wanna go and explore while I can. So I've been sitting in my car for 10 minutes and I can't decide where to go or what I want. 
This is the dilemma that I always have. So this is the restaurant. And I'm about to head inside and I've never eaten by myself except one other time, so. So I just came into the restaurant and it's really cool. It has a lot of lights and I really like it. Um, and then they serve me these, which I don't know what they are, but I am excited to try them. And then I ordered the black bean sauce noodles because I watched TikToks to figure out where I wanted to go. And that's what the girl ate and she said it was her second time meeting those. So I'm excited to try them. I'm all by myself, but I brought my book that I bought the other day. So I'm excited. So I just got my food and my chopsticks and this is what it looks like and I am so excited to try it. It smells really good. Um, I honestly don't know what it is but it's noodles and I'm just excited to try it and see. I don't know what this is. I think it has taste. And it was super fast. I I have been in here for like I don't know. I think about not even ten minutes. It was really fast. So I'm excited. Okay, so I had to pull out these old reliables because I noticed that in the audio you couldn't hear anything. It's really good. The flavor after a while gets like a little overwhelming, but every time I eat it more, I notice the black bean definitely and those were potatoes and the noodles are really good but um i think it was a good hour that i came in because there weren't that many people and if i would have come in like at a busier hour i would have, would have been like really stressed out since i would have been the only person eating and this is my first time eating by myself i'm gonna eat the quail egg Okay, so I just left and I feel really full. I kind of want to go sleep, but there are a few other stores around here and it's only seven o'clock. So I just arrived in my next stop and it is at TJ Maxx and there's a Marshalls, but I went in and there wasn't anything that I liked. Honestly, it just kind of looked really disorganized, but we'll see how TJ Maxx does.
I am back. I honestly only bought the black shirt and I really like the skirt, but it had a hole on it. So I didn't, I didn't want to buy it. I don't know. There was a really weird sound. Anyways, um, before I left, I opened one of these because my uh, car literally smelled like food because of the food that I brought. And I didn't want it to smell like that. I think I'm just gonna head home and then when I get home, I'm gonna show you guys what I bought. Okay, so I finally made it home and I just wanted to show you guys what I bought. So I ended up putting these chips and I was gonna show you, well, I was gonna eat them and tell you what it tasted like, but I feel really full from earlier. So I'll probably do it in the next video or in a different video. Um, I also bought a snow mask and I bought these, which I think they're like rice cakes, but they're made out of rice. I don't really know what they're called. And I finally figured out what this tasted like. It tastes like a, um, there's this other drink that's like white and it's white peach and it tastes just exactly the same. But I appreciate you guys coming along with me to this adventure and I will definitely be making more videos like this. I appreciate you guys watching the video. Thank you so much. My social media is down below. And I hope to see you next time.